Hi, Dan Grodinger here for the Remote Services Group of Baker Hughes, the Ultrasound and Eddy Current Group. I've been with the business about 26 years in a variety of engineering roles uh, from instrument development through probes and applications development. So we put together a series of uh, short videos covering a variety of our instruments, probes, and applications. Hopefully you find these useful in your selling activities. Today I'd like to share with you our thickness gauge product line. Yeah, we have four gauges in our lineup from the very simple, the pocket mic, uh, all-in-one instrument, probe mounted on the bottom, display on top, very simple set of controls. Uh, mainly what you can change on there is calibration for velocity, change your units, change the precision of the measurement. With the pocket mic you're going to be limited for accurate measurements to taking uh, measurements on bare metal. Other than that, it is a very simple, straightforward, put the probe on the part, take a measurement. Uh, moving up to the next step, to the DM5E, two big features that set this apart from the pocket mic. One, of course, is that the probes are separate from the instrument itself. Shown here with the instrument are the four most common probes. The, the instrument does support others. All of the probes are dual probes, dual element probes. As you can see, dual element center barrier. Wide variety of probes available. DA501, general purpose, the most common. DA503 for thicker materials, uh, more attenuated materials, coarse grain structures. And then we have some fingertip probes, the FH2E, again a very general purpose probe, and the DA512, very small contact area. You can reach into pits, complex geometry uh, to take readings. Moving up one more step to the CL5, the CL5 now is a precision gauge where the pocket mic, the DM5E, and the DMS Go are corrosion gauges, giving you a resolution of one one thousandth of an inch or one one hundredth of a millimeter. The CL5 gives you one more digit of precision in each. You can measure to a tenth of a thousandth of an inch or a thousandth of a millimeter. It uses single element probes. Two of the most common are the Alpha 2 DFR, delay tip probe, best suited for thin materials. It's a high frequency probe. Uh, you can measure down to six thousandths of an inch in steel. And we have a, a special variety of the Alpha 2 with a graphite delay tip that's ideal for measuring plastics. For thicker materials, the CA211 is a simple single element direct contact probe. Uh, again, both of these are used to take precision measurements, in, especially in thinner materials. Moving up one more step, the top of the line in the thickness gauges is the DMS Go. It gives you a 5-inch color display, full A scan, nice large readings, and adds a complex data recorder. The CL5 and the DM5E give you simpler data recorders, simple linear and grid files in these cases. The larger display of the DMS Go makes possible uh, much more complex data recorder formats to better model your assets. Um, in addition to that, we offer some other probe options for high temperature work, the DA590 and HT400. Uh, both of these can measure uh, objects that are several hundred degrees uh, Fahrenheit. Limited duty cycle, you have to be careful in how you apply them, but you can measure very hot materials with this. Also, the DMS Go offers a temperature compensation um, so that you get a true thickness measurement, even of very hot materials. Uh, one more option on this is our top coat measurement process and the TC560 probe, and that allows you to simultaneously measure velocity and thickness of bare metals, or you can measure simultaneously coating thickness and base material of coated materials. So that's a, an advanced technique, comes in the advanced version of this instrument. So there you have it, that's our basic thickness gauge product line. Thank you for watching. So to get more information on the instrument you just saw or any other technical aspect of the UT or Eddy Current uh, product line, please reach out to remote services at bhge.com or call our 866 number those will be provided to you uh, in the comments 
down below for if you're seeing this on YouTube, uh, also included in the video. So thank you.